Uh, anyway, uh, what are we doing today? Well, we're still working on the uh, Slumlord Gate and the plus one, that, that one that's replacing the one we already did. Uh, it, there's going to be a lot of grinding today, I think, hopefully, if I get to that point. If I get a... <laughs> it's hot out. I don't know if you can tell. Anyway, uh, first thing we're doing, though, is this is the Slumlord Gate, and we're getting ready to put the lockbox in it. This isn't the type... This is a... This isn't the size lockbox I normally get. I usually get an inch and five eighths for this is inch and a half material. I usually get an inch and five eighths. This one here is an inch and a half, but it's what the uh, client already owned. But you can see what I've done is I build the gate first. I, I don't know if that's the right way to do it or not, but that's the way I do it. I, I built the gate first, and then I cut for the lockbox, and then you've I, you've got angle iron on both. Can't see. The, oops. I've got angle iron here and then on the bottom and it's all clamped to hold the rail straight and then we've got the lockbox clamped in the position where it goes and all I gotta do now is just weld it in so that's what we're gonna do first then um, what I might do is start measuring and cutting the uh, 16 gauge sheet metal that goes in the, the panels that go in and um, and then it's just a lot of grinding and sanding and getting them ready for uh, paint and uh, these will probably more or less finish up at the same time so anyway uh, hopefully soon we get it done and then uh, we can get on to another project that's going to be more exciting and more fun so anyway let's get busy
Hey YouTube, um, yesterday didn't finish off quite the way I had planned. I uh, was hoping to get some grinding done on these gates and uh, it was just so hot. So hot. <laughs> I, what I found myself doing was just sitting in the garage staring at it. And if I'm just going to sit around and stare at something, I'll go do that in the air-conditioned house. So uh, anyway, I packed everything up and and uh, went downstairs and did some stuff on the computer. So uh, today, you can see, you know, yesterday I got the panels, these panels cut. These I'm not real thrilled with, but because you know they, the guy, what he gave me was uh, four foot by ten foot panels. So they don't quite reach. There's a couple of seams in them. Today I'm just grinding and uh, grinding some more. And uh, if I get a real wild hair after I'm done grinding, that gate, this one here, it's just kind of propped up against the uh, shelving. They're uh, rather unloved. Um, I might. Uh, I might give it a coat of paint, but anyway, uh, yeah, that's what we're doing. We're just going to get the grinder out. We're going to do some work on these little panels, uh, you know, hit those with the wire brush. Might do that first just to get that filth off of them, but uh, yeah, let's get started.
think I'm gonna. Uh, I think that's it for this video. We're just going to finish up some stuff. The, uh, the client was just here with the about the the slumlord gate. He was just here, and we had a little bit of a discussion about some things. Like I said, it's, uh, I'm. I think I've mentioned it more than once, but a lot of the materials for this, I didn't buy them. They were, he had hired somebody else to do the work and then he got mad at him because he was welding stuff to an air conditioner and had not, and then he called me and wanted me to do the work. So anyway, uh, what, what they did was the material, the sheet metal that they, that they bought was a 16 gauge uh, cold rolled sheet and it's not long enough to fill these in one piece. So like there's a little seam here, we could put the seam somewhere else in there, I've got another piece of it, you know, that kind of stuff. But he didn't want a seam at all. So what we're gonna do is, um, I'm gonna uh, order a piece of 16 gauge uh, hot roll uh, that fits this piece, and then I've got another, I've got some here that I can do the long strip, and, um, We've got it plenty for the small section, for the smaller half, but we're going to just, that way he doesn't have any seams and we don't have to worry about it and he'll be happy and, and that kind of stuff. Uh, but I'm going to finish, uh, finish up uh, grinding and, uh, uh, and I'll probably pull one of these sheets out and cut it down for the, for the one strip. So uh, until next time, bye.